was gross. Well, hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I have a really weird backdrop today because I am at my parents' house in Florida. As some of you know, if you follow me on social media, as you seeing this video, I am not in Florida anymore. I am doing some pre-filming because we have a little bit of time today and I need to get some stuff done because I'm actually coming home on Tuesday and this video right here, this like this video is going up on Wednesday. So I wanna at least get the footage done so I can edit on the plane or on Tuesday or whenever, like I just need to get it done, you know what I'm saying? So today we are gonna talk about December favorites and I actually brought along all my favorites or things that I've really been loving using in the month of December here because I've actually been here for over a week and I'm going to be here for a total of a week and a half. So that being said, let's get right into this. First things first, even though I'm super hot right now, I am always really stinking cold. If you guys know anything about me, I either run really hot or really cold. I really don't have any in between, but being here in Florida, I'm like, sweltering, the fan is on right now, thank goodness. But when I'm at home, I am cold all the time. Um, it doesn't matter if I turn the heat up, I'm just cold, I don't know. Just, I look outside and I'm like, oh, I need another blanket. So that being said, I drink a lot of tea and this has been my favorite kind of foodish thing of the month. Um, I have been drinking tons and tons of tea and this is the one that I like the best I still don't know how to say it, if it's Twinnings or Twinings, I'm pretty sure it's Twinnings. Uh, it's 100% pure black English breakfast tea. And I'm gonna say this once, cause I know when I edit, I say this a million times, I will link everything down below if I can find it, okay? So everything will be linked below and I need to stop saying that. That should be like one of my resolutions for this upcoming year is to stop repeating myself in videos cause I get really annoyed with myself when I edit. So future Emily gets mad at past Emily a lot when she edits. Another thing I have been absolutely loving is this bad boy. I think I may have mentioned it in a favorites video before, but I don't know. Um, I can't, like I don't go back on my favorites videos and rewatch them to see what I've talked about. Um, I try not to talk about the same things over and over and over, but like if it's truly my favorite, like that's what I wanna talk about because that's why you guys click on the video is because you wanna truly know what my favorites have been for this past month. Whether things roll over month to month, I don't know. I try not to do that. This is my Barefoot Dreams Circle Cardigan, which I absolutely love. I will leave a link below for you guys. Hey, past Emily, stop it. Um, It's from Nordstrom's and it's got these really nice pockets. It's really difficult to see. Um, let me see if I can try it on and maybe like the camera angle isn't that weird. Um, the reason I really like this, and I do wear this actually in Florida, um, the last couple of days it's actually been quite cold here, um, but I love the way that this looks. And if I stand up, oh, nope, you're just getting a nice boob shot. All right, good thing I'm not wearing a low cut thing. Let's see. There we go. So it's just like very open in the front and like very baggy, which I like. And then it's got these really nice um, pockets right here too. So it's just like very open and flowy. Sorry about the thing in the way. But yeah, I really like this and I like that the arms are really long too and it's really soft. It washes up really nicely. I'm gonna take it off now because it's really hot in here, even with the fan going. Um, but I love it and it's just, it feels like a blanket on your skin. It just feels nice. So when I've been traveling also, that's been really nice to have because you never know if it's gonna be too hot or too cold on the plane and I'd rather be prepared and then I like to just kind of drape that over myself if I need it. If not, it just goes like underneath my seat, you know what I'm saying? I've also been wearing it a lot at home um, in Cambridge, so it's just one of my go-to slip it on, forget about it, especially if I'm like gonna run to the grocery store or something. It's a little bit dressier than like my big hoodies that I like to wear all the time. I swear I'm like a 12 year old boy on the inside. I'm just like in hoodies and just like baggy pants all the time, I don't know. That's what I, like that, that, Like that's my uniform for my off time. And PS, like I think I've worn this shirt in like every single video for the last like four or five videos or something. But like this is what I wear on the weekends when I'm not doing anything. Like I just wear like a t-shirt. This one says Minneapolis and then it says STP on the bottom, like Minneapolis, St. Paul. I got it at Target. Um, but yeah, I just wear like the same like 10 to 12 outfits over and over. So I don't really, I don't know. I don't actually like pay attention to what I'm wearing in a video too much. Maybe I should care more. I don't know. 
You guys don't seem to care if I wear the same crap in the video every single time, whatever. But moving along, this is a favorites video and not talking about my weird wardrobe. Okay, so my next favorite is, you guessed it, my whipping post large messenger bag. This thing is freaking gorgeous. I've actually been using this as my carry-on. I just filmed a second ago um, and did filming my what's in my bag for my carry-on for this. That is going to be going up later. I don't know when though. Um, I need to look at my posting schedule, but I didn't bring it with me. I'm such a bad planner girl. I didn't even bring my planner with me on this trip. Like at all. I know that's crazy, but I didn't because I didn't want to lug it around, first of all. And then also, I just didn't want to take time away from family time, even though I'm like literally sitting in here doing this. But people are taking naps and like watching football right now. So I'm not really missing anything to like sit in here for 30 minutes and film this. So I think we're okay. But again, I really just didn't want to lug that and then like lug all the like accoutrements that go with it, like the stickers and the washi and all of that. And, you know, I'm always going to be missing something. So what I've been doing is actually just like writing it down. I'm going to post plan, like go back and plan. So I'll be doing some of that when I get back to Minnesota. And speaking of the bag I just showed, I actually purchased a couple of things from Amazon and I'm pretty much in love with them. They kind of go in the bag, but this is my MacBook Pro 15 inches inside of this. This bad boy I am like in love with. It is a, it feels like felt laptop case. And in the very front, it says Amazon basics. Let me see if it will actually, I don't know if it's focusing very well for you, but that's okay. This color is a slightly different than the actual bag that I have, but it's nice. It's got this like little envelope pouch. My computer's in it right now. It's got this nice deep pocket, goes the entire depth of the pouch. And then if you want to close that up, on the back side, it has two more slip pockets. So you can put like flatter cords or things like that in there, which is kind of nice. So I love this thing and this is like my total jam. I like to have a little bit of protection on my computer if I can. Here's a little pouch that goes along with it. This bad boy is not from, well it's from Amazon but it's not like that Amazon brand. This is from Inatech and it's got this brown, it almost reminds me of like a, like a hair tie, like the old hair ties that I used to use that were like really bad for my hair by the way. Um, and then inside of here I just have like some cords and things. So love this little pouch. I'm actually thinking about getting a second one. I think I might get a second one um, to put some other things in there, but love this thing. And it's so helpful and it actually goes into my large messenger bag really, really well. And I really like the way that it looks. My last favorite of the month is going to be these. I know what you're thinking, like slippers in Florida, what's your problem? Well, let me tell you what my problem is. I need hard sold shoes while I'm here. My parents, this actual room, if you can see the floor, because I kind of angled it a little bit, this room and all the bedrooms actually have a carpeting, which is really nice. But the main living area is like this huge, just like open space. If you guys had watched my Vlogmas videos, you would have seen it. Um, I came here on day 17, if you guys are interested in looking back. Um, but I need hard bottomed shoes because their floors are so hard on my feet. Um, I actually purchased these three years ago when I was here for Christmas. These are the Isotoner brand, put the little thing up here so future Emily can find it and possibly link it for you. These are the Isotoner brand. They're just like a really nice gray. It's got like a little fuzzy lining around it, which is also gray. But I really like these and I have been wearing these suckers out while I have been here. So pretty much we get back and I throw these on because it like hurts the bottoms of my feet so bad. So I think that is going to wrap it up for my December favorites. Sorry it wasn't as comprehensive of a list that I normally do, but like I said, I'm on vacation right now. So I just wanted to show you all the things that I have been using throughout the month, as well as on my vacation that I'm truly loving. If you like these favorites videos, make sure to give it a good old thumbs up and let me know that you want to see more so every month I can bring you more. Also, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. I am here every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday with new content for you guys. Thank you all so much for hanging out with me today for a little portion of your day. I really, really appreciate it. And I hope you all are having a fantastic day and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye guys.